How you doing? My name is Tariq McGilberry. Uh, this was my first year of placement. I was placed at a re-entry program. Uh, my full-time job is at a mental health agency. In neither setting do I really have much interaction with families. Uh, I normally, typically, um, deal with people on a one-on-one -on -one basis at the mental health agency. At times, families do get involved, and uh, families try to help their loved ones that we service uh, succeed at their goals or achieve different things. Um, in my own personal life, the way my family was, was uh, we were pretty much raised independent. Like I have an uh, older brother, younger sister, and my parents stayed together uh, the whole time. and They're still together now. Um, my brother and sister started working at a very young age. I was the one that hung out and liked to do neighborhood stuff, I guess. Um, I got my life together later in life, so I was pretty much the, uh, I guess, scapegoat of the family. Like, if anything happened, they would say I did it, or um, they would think automatically that it was me. They wouldn't even uh, go to anybody else. Um, I think that can benefit me with certain clients, like clients at the re-entry program, I think uh, my past uh, can definitely allow me to relate better and um, share experiences that some of the people at the re-entry program went through as far as, and I feel, I guess, as far as the mental health agency, it's, it can still be the same because like some of them might have dealt with different issues. Uh, I feel like going through some of the stuff I went through in my past and being in the position I am now, I uh, can definitely provide a model for some people because like a lot of people look at me like they don't believe that I've ever been through any like adversity or different things or even face-to-face uh, -face with the law or whatever you want to say because of uh, what I've been trying to achieve over achieve over the last couple of years, and like I've done a lot of community oriented things, and I've worked in mental health, and I'm trying to get this master's degree. And some people don't believe that my past is my past, but to me that might be like a badge of honor to feel that I've come so far that people are in disbelief of my past. But I think that helps because I know what the client has gone through or is going through and I can relate if they allow me to. Uh, but that's pretty much it. Thank you.